Amen. Amen. Nasimima na imami wa Jesus Christ. Thank our Lord Jesus Christ. For this moment will be in Easter. A beautiful morning we came to praise and worship God. We give praise for what he has done. I thank God for all of us. Starting from our pastors. And all the Christians in general. Praise be to God. For giving us this Easter. If we don't feast, we commit a sin. Because feasting is a command from God. In the Old Testament and the New Testament, Jesus said, do this in remembrance of me. We praise God, therefore, for giving us this feast of Easter, the days of Christ Jesus, when Jesus was was captured. It was on Friday. On Thursday evening, he shared the supper with his disciples. They shared Easter. And on, that, on Friday at 5 a.m. he was arrested. He was being tortured a lot on Friday. And every Christian on Friday was supposed to be very sorrowful because of the torture of Christ Jesus. He was supposed to be in his blood. Flesh, flesh, blood. That was on Friday. Jesus was crucified on Friday. He died and he was buried that night. And on Saturday he was in the grave. Christians were so disappointed because he had died. Christ was in the grave. And on Sunday morning, Jesus Christ is alive. Now Jesus is alive. It is a time at Jerusalem. There was a lot of jubilation. And on the time was like this. Christ was together with people. Jesus was with his disciples. Jesus has resurrected. Praise be to God and honor. Because of those three days, I have feasted. We praise Jesus Christ. Because all those days, the church of Christ was open. This church was open. We, are, we were feasting. We were, feasting. we were remembering our Lord Jesus Christ. And I thank God for that. For Easter. Easter. Our Christianity is wrapped up in Easter moments. And where Christianity is, is in Easter. A person without Easter in their heart, you are not a Christian. You are far away from it. You are so far away. Even though you don't hear it today, but you will understand when Christ comes back, when Christ comes back, he will tell you that you are never in Easter. He will tell you that you never knew his plan. And he will tell you, you bad servant. And you bad and you rejected person and you never received me go to eternal fire and go to eternal judgment because you never knew Isa because you never understood Isa 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 our Isa and Paul Rodin said and he said we are naked of the elder or the elder clothing I say because our Easter is Christ Jesus may you cover uncover and cover all the a person can feast in Easter while still wearing the old clothing while still the old life and the older life people that are head it had no God in it and there was no sharing in it when a person never comes to serve in Easter you are all the you are in the older garment. But 
jamais non ça avait signé pas te rana dans ta fougue Dieu sous quand même c'est quoi Dieu soit ta rafouille Quand Dieu c'est notre date Dieu soit ta rafouille Quand Dieu c'est notre comme ça Dieu soit ma visa ta singiro Dieu soit good gospel Dieu soit le Bukhari Dieu soit no gospel Elle toi la fougue en go Dieu ça c'est ça Tu chaka Dieu va one Fasa que yo mi c'est le no riche Il sign the old testament No go Is that Yamburu musembero wa ke You uncover the old garment No go yamburu musembero wa ke You take away the past garment You rob in jakera All the old garments And it become a new creation That is our Easter That is our Easter And that Easter Is Christ Jesus It is Christ Jesus Amen Praise be to Jesus Easter, Easter Dear Easter Long ago People used to do their normal deeds. There was no heaven that time. No one had told us about heaven. Every people were doing their normal deeds. That is the elder garment. And the throne said. It was long ago. They were doing their slavery deeds. They used to work. They did not rest at all. They were slaves. They were born. They were enslaved. They were enslaved. Any person who did. You have not seen heaven yet. You are still in the elder garment. Because it's the older garment. When the Jews were still in Egypt. They were in slavery. They were in happy. They were in no time even a little moment to rest. But Easter came. And they rest. Easter is in rest. And they say there is a heaven. We cannot work all the time. We cannot work all the time. Tell your neighbor don't work all the time. Tell your neighbor don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Is that is here? Don't work all the time. Is the Sabbath. It is the Sabbath. The Sabbath. You rest and think about heaven. You rest and think. You meditate. You, you, understand. you meditate on the right thing. And you say, This world is not my own. This world is not my own. People don't know that this world is not our home. If you remember Isa, God bless you. God bless you. Let's read the word of God as we conclude. Pasak. Easter. Pasak. Easter. Pasak. Easter. Pasak. Easter. Bavani Pasak. Brethren, Easter. Gramgenzomo Pasak. Tell your neighbor Easter. Pasik. Easter. Usome Matayo igice cya 28 numunani numurongo murongo wa mbere kugeza kuri 28 Matthew 28 Matthew Mundu zi gusoma usome uyuze We read the old chapter of Matthew 28 Mutegere 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 Listen Tegere mutegere amakuru Tegere inkuru nziza zo iki gitoro Listen to the good news this morning. Kuzuka kwa Yesu. Nuko umusi wa sabato ushize. Yego. Kuambero yimi siri ngui umuseke wenda gutambika. Maria magadarena na Maria wundi baja kureva cha gituro. Yego. Haba ho igishiti change. Yego. Kuko maraika umga mimana. Yaramanu tavu ya mnijuru. Yego. Abiri nduri gitare achichara ho. Yego. Ishusho ya yasaga numurabzo. Yego. Ni mnyenda ya yera gankuruhura. Yego. Baba rinzi wa mwonye. Wagirubgo wa hindi mishiti. Yego. Kwa sana wapfuye. Yego. Ariko maraika abgira wagorati. Yego. Ngevge ho mngitinya. Yego. Kukonzi yuko mshaka yesu wabamge. Yego. Wabamge. Haa. Nari hano kuko ya azute. 
Huko ya vuze. Yego. Ni muze mureba humgami ya rarjam. Yego. Ni mugende vuwa mugira wigishkwawe. Yuko ya zute. Yego. Kandi azaba wanziriza kujigari raya. Yego. Iyoni ho muza muwone radore. Dabi wabgiye. Yego. Bafa mugituro vuwa waftugo wa wivini neza neza bjinshi. Yego. Wiru kanga waja kugira wigishkwawe. Yego. Maze sahura na vo. Yego. Ala wugirati. Na mahoro. Aha. Bara mwegera bamufata ku birenge baramupfukamira maze Yesu arababwira ati mwitinya ni mugende mubwire bene data baje igarira ya niho bazambonera yego bakigenda bamwe muri abo barinzi baja kumurwa yego baja mu murwa babwira abatambyi bakuru ibyabaye byose bateranira hamwe n'abakuru Bajinama, bagurira basirikare feza nyinshi bati muje mvuga muti abigishwa be baje nijoro dusinziriye baramwiba umutegeka naramu umutegeka naramuka byumvise umutegeka naramuka byumvise tuzamwemeza namwe tuzabakiza amakuba nuko bahera ko bijanira ifeza babigenza uko bohejwe ijambo ryamamara mu bayuda na bugingo nubu kagire nkuru mwumve Yesu atuma bigishwa be mu mahanga yose nuko abigishwa 11 bajigarira ya ku musozi Yesu yabategetse yego bamubonye baramfukamira yego Ariko bamwe barashidikanya. Nuko Yesu arabegera avugana nabati. Yego. Na hawe butware bwose mu ijuru no mwisi. Nuko mugende muhindura wa mu mahanga yose. Abigishwa mu babatiza mu izina rya data wa twese n'iryo umwana n'umwuka wera. Mubigisha kwitondera ibyo nababwiye byose. Kandi dore ndi kumwe namwe iminsi yose kugeza ku mpera y'isi. Amen. Amen. Tulangirize mwa korinto baka wili Gite cha gatano Murongo wa chumi na kane Tugeze kuli murongo wili narimu Second Corinthians chapter 5 verse 14 Urukundo lwa kristo rura duhata Yego Kukotkwe mejwe yuko ngukumge ya firi ya bose Ariko bose bafuye Yego Kandi ya firi ya bose Kugira nga bari hobe gukomezwa kuwa hoku vgao Yego Ahugo wabe hoku vguo wabafiri ye Akana wazukira Nicho gituma uhere enone Tutaza giruo dutekereza Dukuri kijama sekuruzi Yego Nugo aliko tukwa tekeleza ga kristo Yego Aliko noneho ni tuki mutekeleza durchu Umunuwe siyari muri kristo Awari ichari mwegisha Ujakera wabishize Dole vjose wihindu tsevisha Yego Aliko ibjo vjose vituruka kumana Yili unze natu kwe kuga kristo Yego Ika duhumurimo kuku Ukuyunga na bandi Kadu humurimo ukuyunga na bandi Kuko muri kristo Arimi mana yiyungie na wari mngisi Ni ya wa iki tuwara hivi chumuro vjao Iki wa wara hivi chumuro vjao Kandi no neho Ya tu wiki jijambo riki ungo zuro Eme Nga kiri jambo jima Receive the word of God Nga kiri jambo jima Receive the word of God We thank God Yeko Thank you for reading. Others are not reading with us. But God bless you still. Welcome, brother. I remember him as a young boy. Now he's an old man. I didn't know you're here. Welcome. Amen. 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 Praise be to Jesus. Praise be to Jesus. We praise the Lord always. I'm going to show you a short testimony on the resurrection of Jesus. Because of time. A little testimony about the resurrection of our Lord Jesus. We spoke about the death of Jesus. We share that on Thursday. Even yesterday on Saturday. Even yesterday our guest spoke on the same. 
about the death Kuko Yesu, because Jesus kuwakane, starting from that day yari murufu. he was in death tanu yari murufu. on Friday he was in Kuwaga death yari murufu. on Saturday he was in death and on Sunday morning yes, Jesus is alive from the grave yes, Jesus, Jesus is alive from the grave yes, Jesus, Jesus is alive from the grave yes, Jesus, yes, Jesus, Jesus is alive Jesus is alive Jesus is alive the death of the Lord Jesus we know it's important death you don't accept death every person has lost someone there are two great things in common and the first one they have a lot of sorrow and sadness when a person loses someone when a person loses their hands when a person loses their last one they have a heart that is so sorrowful that is almost killing them they have a lot of pain and it's so painful and it's that is about to pass and the second thing they have they have the Bible says that when a person loses someone they have shame they feel like they killed a person you feel ashamed they is shameful when a person loses someone it makes you despise and you feel ashamed before people it is something that has not looked good is disgraceful. It is the reason widows are rejected when they lose their husbands because there is that thing in it. But the death of our Lord Jesus, the death of our Lord Jesus, it has nothing of those two. The death of our Lord Jesus, it is a our hearts our hearts with the death of Jesus it has joy in it it has happiness in it and happiness that cannot be explained Amen 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 Praise be to the Lord Jesus the death of the Lord Jesus and the second thing it can, you can the I boast of the cross I boast of the cross of Jesus The of Christ is not shameful You boast of it Because The death of Christ Is All the writings that Is and that way the death of the Lord Jesus at the cross Jesus finished it all all the evidences that accused us when you commit a mistake the devils are secretaries they are always writing that is a case against and they put it in the court they write they write when you abort they write it down when you commit other three they write it down when you lie they write it down when you steal they write it down when you despise someone they write it down and this place is so bad don't despise one another don't despise one another. If we say let's stand up and receive our guests, please respect in order to be respected. It is a principle. Is it hard to respect someone? When you don't respect, they write it down. They write it. That is an accusation. That is accepting the quote of the Lord. In the quote of the Lord, there is no lawyer. 
that can do all of this. They have advocates and they have other laws that they put in place and they accuse you of something and they can make you free if you have sins by the court of the Lord Jesus the court of God the court of Christ Jesus there's not like a court in Kenya there's no there are no advocates that can come and maybe some of them have only one advocate in that court in that position is God only Christ alone there's no other advocate there's no one at all they all live alone no one will stand before the Lord. No one will stand in the court of God. Only one advocate we have. Only Christ the Son of God. He finished it all. Long ago speaking with people. He finished it all. He finished it. I shall say he finished it. The Bible says that. That he went out. And he told God. And he said the people get it. He said the people know them. And left them in the world. Wait for them. Accept them. Because there is over. It is finished. They are focused on Jesus Christ. It is over. Who don't believe in him. They have no advocate for them. Only one. Only judgment will be before them. Judgment. Say amen. Amen. Say amen. The Christ of the Lord Jesus. The cause of Jesus. All the evidence is what they All the cases are finished. Are you okay? Everything that you did. It will finish at the cross of Jesus. When you see the death of Christ Jesus. When you see the crucifixion. Christ is in us, the cross. So the case. All the cases are gone. And all the evidence are destroyed. All the evidence is destroyed. Back at home, they are destroyed. All the evidence is destroyed. Every evidence is destroyed. All the evidence is destroyed. Every evidence against you is destroyed. It is at the cross of Jesus. Every evidence is destroyed. Is there, so the Christ of Jesus is not shed. And we boast of the cross. Because it is destroyed every evidence. If they put a sins on the surface, you cannot get out of your house. You cannot get out of your house. You cannot, you cannot get out of your house. And your heart is, your heart is on fire to you. If they put your sins on the floor, you cannot come out of people. You cannot stand before people. But everything that you did, everything you are shameful about, Jesus finished it all. Tell your neighbor, all the cases are over. All the cases are over. It is over. The death of Christ Jesus. May you receive the death of our Lord Jesus. Receive the death of Christ. I love the death of Christ. I love you, Lord Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Amen. The death of our Lord Jesus. Yes, Jesus was crucified. And he finished it all. About saving us, meaning that Christ, he took his life and gave it to us and took us and gave it to himself and then he was punished. Meaning that Christ, he was crucified, he died, he finished it to bring us to God, the death of Christ. We sought God. We had God. We received God. We walk with God. We walk with God. Even though you can't see him. All that are in Christ Jesus. They have God. They live with God. And they walk with him. They live with him.
Amen. Now we live with him. That was the singer said. What did he say? He came to us. In death. In the death of praise. He came to us. And he lives with us. That is God himself. To the devil. I want to tell you. About you who died. If you never resurrected. In case you never resurrected. There will not be Church of Christ TV will not be today. Will not be here today. Today. We will not have come here today. We not have come here today. Amen. 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 The first testimony that is about the resurrection Christ <laughs> it is the existence yes, of the Christ. Christ. When Jesus was arrested, he was together with his disciples. When they came to arrest him, the and the soldiers of the Romans, Jesus asked, Who do you want? And they said, well, Jesus of Nazareth. And said, It is me that you want. It says, and they knelt down. And they and he asked them again. And said, so Who do you want? And they said, We want Jesus of Nazareth. And he said, It's me. Arrest me and let them go. Jesus was so merciful. When you are with God, you cannot lack anything. When you are with Jesus, you can have it all. And Jesus told them, He said that, It is me. Arrest me. And then, Let them go. Let them go. Let them go. Jesus, His disciples are separated. Every person went their way. And they went afraid. That time Peter. And he says, You are the disciple of Jesus. And he says, No. I never knew this man at all. I don't know him at all. Johanna, Johanna. John, John. Johanna, Johanna. John, John, the disciple. He was the first of them all. Johanna. John. John was a smart man. He lived at the chest of Jesus. When they arrested Jesus, those women that I told you about, together with John, they followed him. One step after another. Step after step. Step by step. And Jesus went. They followed him. And they followed him. And came to the cross. And Jesus was crucified. And those were the same. John Mary Magdalene and Jesus died when they were there. And then John made a cross. He spoke with the other men. He said, no, what shall we do as John? We don't have any money. And we can leave him on the cross. We're supposed to bury him. What shall we do? Who such young man can do such things like John did? Where can we find such a boy? Who? Where can we find such a young man? Who remembers the church of the Assyrian? Which man can we find? Who lives with the church and not marry? And they have that responsibility. John, John, John. John the disciple. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise be to the Lord Jesus. Praise be to Jesus. Why he believe in the Jesus? And not for the winner. They are winners. They are the testimony. These are the testimony. They are the witnesses of Christ. They were with Christ. And they were never separated from him. Not even for a second. They were together with Christ. They were there. They were there. In justification, they were there. In the resurrection, they were still there. Amen. 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 And they said, Joseph, 
about the resurrection of Christ Jesus. It is the grace was the grave was, the grave was open. There was no body in it. Jesus resurrected. Jesus resurrected. Jesus rose from the dead. Jesus rose from the dead. The Bible says that the people that says woke up in the morning Mary Magdalene woke up very early. Magdalene and no peace when Jesus died. She was only walking and walking around. Maria. Mary. Mary Magdalene. She never slept at all. She was the first to wake up and went to the other Mary. 
Where they went to the grave very early. When they came to the grave, they found it open. And then she cried a lot. She cried. She said, Where is my lover? Yes, Where is Jesus? She cried because she never found him. And then she found a man. She said, Maybe it's the soldier. And close to the person. And as where is Jesus? And the person spoke to her. Amen. Amen. And said, Magdalene, you woman, Magdalene. When Jesus was being nice to women, she used to say, you woman, woman, a woman is a good thing. A good thing. A clean person. But because of people nowadays, they don't read the Bible. When you tell them, you woman, they say you have abused them. It's better you tell them, you man. Mm. And said, you woman. When they spoke, Mary was afraid. Mary did not know the person at first. And he said, I plead with you. I plead with you. Can you tell me where you are, Jesus? You are here. Please show me where Jesus is. Mary, Mary. Mary Magdalene. She was thinking about Show me where you put Jesus. And Jesus said, don't do me. I'm okay. I am arrived. And she was amazed. And he said, don't touch me. Don't touch me. When God loves a person, they show him. Yes. Jesus showed himself to his mother. And the first one was Mary Magdalene. Because she loved him. When the Bible says, follow me. And you follow my Lord. I will ask my father. He will come and live with you. And I will show myself to you. John 14. <laughs> 15. I will reveal myself. I will reveal myself. And he said, You are the first person of redeeming. You are the first person of redeeming. Don't touch me. Let me go to my father. But go and tell my disciples that you meet at Galilee. For the gospel. Let's meet at Galilee. Amen. Amen. Let's meet at Galilee. Let's meet at Galilee. Let's meet at Galilee. Mary Magdalene. And she walked with other Mary. And they ran and told the disciples. When they met with them. Peter and John. Amen. 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 And they told them the good news. Peter and John. They ran to confirm that Jesus was resurrected. The resurrection. Jesus is alive. Jesus is alive. Whether you get him or not, he rose from the dead. He rose from the dead. He rose from the dead. He is in heaven because of Jesus is in heaven with God. Jesus resurrected. Jesus has risen. Jesus rose from the dead. Jesus is alive. Amen. Amen. Peter and John ran. John and the news and he was so happy. How am I led? Where was I? And then he ran. He was still a young man. And he went before Peter. When he came to the grave. He saw the sheets. When he saw the linen, he turned to Peter and said to him, What Mary said is the truth. Yes, we are. Jesus has risen. Yes, we are. Jesus has risen. He's not here. And then Peter came and said, It's not possible. Where they dated my son, 
and when they were so hungry they rejected because I have to confirm it my brother she came to the grave and he looks around the Bible says that he took the crap on his head and he said to Jesus as Jesus meaning that was binding him he is not together with the scar Jesus as Jesus Jesus as Jesus 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 responded and we have testimony that Jesus is alive because when they came to the grave they found it open even today the grave is still open it is still open. Whether you believe him or not, he rose from the dead. In the second testimony, yes. Jesus, after resurrecting, power came to the disciples. Petero, Peter, who was an afraid man, Peter, who feared the Jews, Peter, who feared the Romans, he, he preached yes. them. And Jesus rose from the dead. And he came to the disciples. The Lord says that when he came to them, he blessed the blessing. And he came to the Christians. He sent them the Holy Spirit. He was an offender. He became a powerful man. And he said in public, the Jews and the priests who crucified Jesus Christ, who bet him to death. And he told them, you people, whoever you crucify, him who crucified, he resurrected. And the priest one morning, when Jesus had resurrected, and they preached to 3,000 people, and the good news is what he meant. He came to their hearts, he spoke the truth, and all of them asked him, and they asked that one, what can you do, Peter? To be like you. And he said, nothing but repent. The power of resurrection. That made Peter stand. And tell them that openly. He was accusing them openly. And telling them on their cheeks. That Christ. Because Christ was resurrected. Say amen. 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 And that testimony. That I prepared today to tell you that will make you believe Christ rose from the dead. Saul, Paul today, the Bible said he was a Pharisee. He was at the foot of heaven here. And religious man. And then he did all things. He used to accuse the church. And he hated the disciples. He was one of those who killed him. Among who killed the disciples of Christ. And Jesus resurrected. He revealed to him like he did to me. And he called him on the way to Damascus. And he said, Saul, Saul, why do you accuse me? Acts chapter 9. And he said, who are you, my king? And he came to him. Saul, now Paul. He changed. Nothing can change Christians. But the resurrection of Christ Jesus. Jesus never was born. Paul was Saul. Who was Saul before? He could not have changed. He had principles. Religious principles. That he was the He was principles. About religion. That was so fully impaired. He used to boast that as a nephew. To boast that he's a nephew. And those made him a liar. And nothing can change people in the direction of Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen. God said it himself. And he said, Now, I don't think about my ancestors. My ancestry is gone. He never said I'm a Jew. He said it many times. And he said religion means nothing. He said circumcision or not is nothing. It was a custom for the Jews like that. And he said stop all those. 
Don't teach those two people. It is a lie. It is a lie. It is a lie. It is a lie. And he says, circumcision or not. So it is the same. Same amen. Amen. And he says, what is valuable? <laughs> it is Christ who is crucified. Now you are not about the ancestry. Don't think about him in the ancestry. Because the death of Christ and his resurrection it was above ancestry. It was above the thinking of people. They were soldiers. They were soldiers. Prevent Jesus from rise. Jesus rose. Jesus is alive. It is a sign that Jesus is Jesus resurrected by the changing of people. And I love you. Say, Mamma, if you have not changed Christ, I will not kill you. You have not received his resurrection. The day you know the resurrection Christ. you will change, you will belong to your father and mother. You will not count your ancestry. You will belong to Jesus. People change by Jesus. People don't know resurrection will never change. They will never change. They will never change. Jesus rose. And the power was filled. People change. People were saved. The Bible says the first reverence of the church is the mother of is a brother of Jesus. He changed when Jesus was resurrected. Jesus rose and he said, This is not my brother. This is the son of God. This is not the son of my mother. So you are mama. She, he does not belong to mama. It was my mother's son. He could not have resurrected. <laughs> Testimonies that Jesus rose from the dead. It's the changing of people. They change. Come from their line. Come from custom. Come from custom. Come from sin. Jesus is alive. Jesus rose. Who are prostitutes. They speak the gospel. Who are thieves. They speak Christ. Who never knew to speak. They speak him. Who never did good things. They are haters. They become lovers. The resurrection prays. It is power that changes us. They receive the word of God. Jesus is the light. Jesus is the light. Jesus is the light. If you are changed, it is because Christ rose from the dead. There is changing. There is changing. Who are the resurrection? They change. They change. They are changed. They are changed. It is a sign. A testimony. a testimony of the resurrection of Jesus. Say, Mommy. Say, Mommy. Say, Mommy. Hallelujah. Amen. Stand up so that we can take the Holy Communion and remember Christ Jesus. We are going to sing one song. Then they bring the basket to the Jesus and orphans. We are going to give a prayer. We are going to sing Hallelujah, I was saved. Hallelujah, I was set free. And we thank God because Christ rose from the dead. It is the reason we become pastors. It is the reason we are apostles in the church of Jesus. It is the reason we are singers. It is the reason you are a woman who believes in God. If Jesus never rose from the dead, the gospel is speak of me nothing. It cannot help people at all. It can't help people. People who don't drink their food. They are saying, so if this boy is raised. We are raised with Christ Jesus because we died with him. We come to the communion. Seeing that I die with him and I resurrect with him. 
Because when he arrives, they have Christ in them. They will resurrect in truth. I thank God for the Holy Communion. They should tell me I'm not baptized, they cannot take the Holy Communion. When I received a good gospel, when I was not born again, and I accepted him, and I used to want to take the Holy Communion, but the pastors could stop me, and then I will continue to pray, but that will come to the communion while still praying, I will need to stand and pray. And wish all of them to complete. And I said, God, if I have not taken it literally, but, but I'm drunk in spiritual times. I never went out at all. I went to the I came to the church. Not when I was not born. I came to the church. And then that was it. I never went outside. I used to stay and pray. Because I am not allowed to take it. But I drink it spiritually. I receive it spiritually. So that even the day I die, you will resurrect me and live. Jesus will raise who took the communion. He will raise who took the communion. He was his boy. He was his boy. Yeah, the people we raise. But now, we are people, men and women, are in the church, but not They look out to the communion and they went, they went. But I thank God, Jesus. Because I never came my search before. And I will never walk out there until Christ comes back. I ask you brothers and sisters, come to Christ. Come closer to the communion. There is nothing else needed of you but to repent and to receive Christ. There is no effort. That's for nothing. I one God. I baptized them. As mortal. And they say, I believe in Christ Jesus. Please baptize me. Apostle, please baptize me. So that I can take the Holy Spirit. baptize me because I believe. But I believe. I have Christ Jesus. I have Accept his word. And I read it. Please baptize me. Please baptize me and make me. And I baptize Jesus. He comes to the Holy Spirit. And others go outside who are younger than him. Those that are with him and all the others. They go away from Jesus. They will not run away from the mountain. No one can. They have refused to be born again. That's why we are born again. It's just born again. But to stop and to let go of it. And to let go of it. We are born again. We are born again. We are born again. We are born again. So for the sins and come to the Holy Communion. But judgment is coming. After this there is judgment. Jesus spoke it once. That this is the year of mercy. 